Hello and welcome to Get Out Weekend. I'm Mandy Zajac with the East Valley Tribune and you're watching the webcast where we give you some of our favorite things to do over the weekend. It is almost Cinco de Mayo and in Chandler here at the downtown library courtyard. That means one thing, the annual running of the Chihuahuas. The races, which start at 2 p.m. Saturday, are part of a bigger Cinco de Mayo celebration. During the day-long festival, a king and queen chihuahua will be chosen, with a $75 grand prize and cape going to the winners. A centennial chihuahua will also be chosen this year, since Chandler's celebrating its 100th birthday, and that dog will receive a $100 prize, a cape, and a trophy. The fastest dogs in the races will also be honored with trophies and prizes. The celebration also features a lowrider car show, a children's health fair, chihuahua adoption booths, and food, music, and other entertainment. It's a big hit every year. All right, next up, if futuristic fiction favorites like The Hunger Games have captivated the imaginations of your family, you might want to check out First Saturdays for Families over at the ASU Art Museum. Children will be encouraged to imagine the future via activities that correspond with an art exhibition called Emerge, Redesigning the Future. Kids will get to design objects from clay that might play a role in the future, then place their creations in the exhibition. They'll also be able to create electronic music with the help of ASU art students, paint or draw their vision of the future, and go on a scavenger hunt through the museum for symbols of a civilization. The free program is open to children ages 4 to 12 and their families. All materials are provided and free parking is available across 10th Street in the Ceramics Research Center lot. Just be sure to sign in when you get to the museum lobby. And finally, it's opening weekend out at Salt River Tubing and they're throwing a rock and rodeo to celebrate. Shuttle service starts 9 a.m. May 5th and 6th at Tubing Headquarters out on the Tonto National Forest northeast of Mesa. $15 gets you an inner tube and a bus ride to and from the water. They'll have a radio station, Camel Country 108, out there, plus line dancing lessons to keep you entertained before and after you climb off the bus. You can choose to float anywhere from two to four hours on the cool and scenic river. Just be sure to wear plenty of sunscreen, bring a cooler full of drinks to keep you hydrated, and keep your eyes peeled for wildlife. The last float trip departs at 3 p.m. each day. The first 500 people there each day will get a free cowboy boot can koozie. All right, guys, there's lots more going on this weekend, including a really big Cinco de Mayo party over at Tempe Marketplace, and it's comic book day at comic stores across the valley. Uh, you can also head out to Turf Paradise. Uh, Saturday is a great time to go if you've never been there or if you haven't been in a long time. They're having a Cinco de Derby party with uh, live horse racing, uh, mint juleps, margaritas, tacos, barbecue, uh, live music. They've also got face painting, pony rides, and bounce houses for the kids. So. Uh, definitely a fun thing to do if you feel like taking the half hour or so drive out there to the racetrack. To get connected to all of these things, follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and you can check out our homepage. On Twitter, we're doing lots of ticket giveaways these days, so you don't want to miss that. Whatever you do, be sure to get out there, make it a great weekend, and we'll see you back here next time for more ideas.